Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Mike here, and we're gonna touch base on one thing that you can do that's gonna make your tractor perform much better and be safer. Uh, these tractors are built, you know, like this one is designed to lift almost a ton, almost 2,000 pounds. Uh, it's designed to push and pull quite a bit, lift, like I said, uh, but it doesn't have the weight to counteract whatever that is that you're doing to perform and also to keep you on the ground when you do lift those heavy loads or you are pulling something on a slope or on a hill. I've been in contact with RimGuard. They were kind enough to sponsor this video. Let me show you what I do in my part-time job at the dealership, encouraging people to use RimGuard to add weight and ballast to their tractor right where you need it the weight right where you need it. So check out the video. I do a little experiment, not super scientific, but a little experiment to show you what it does for you when you're using your tractor. Thanks for tuning in. Okay guys, well in the process of uh, staging this exercise of filled tires versus non-filled tires, I have some tires on pallets and I was moving them out. This is an unfilled tractor, CK model. Uh, the loader's rated at over 1,900 pounds, but the rear tires are not filled. So this shows you that the ability of the tractor is limited by the fact that it's not having filled tires, not having that ballast in the back. And actually, I was just getting ready to move these tires out to flat ground. I stepped off the tractor and that rear wheel came off the ground. And so I'm just going to show you getting back on the tractor, the extra 200 pounds ish in my case. And then when we're going to be adding ballast to this in a little bit this afternoon, what a difference it's going to make. I got off and it went up, but when I got back on, but when you got on it went down? Oh yeah. Wow. Makes a huge difference. All right, so we're back. We got on some flat ground with this unit. So this tractor is a new tractor, unfilled tires, and we're gonna be uh, testing, lifting up this weight of these four tires with unfilled tires in the back. And what we find out about these tractors, these compact tractors and others, of course, is that they have the capability to do a lot, but they need the ballast. And that's one thing they don't have. Even when you add implements in the back, it can be different for you. So we're gonna try this test. We'll do a couple things. Later on today, we're gonna fill these tires and then we'll try the exercise again.
lots of scary stuff. I don't know if I got off. All right, I'm not a scientist or anything, <laughs> or a physics major or any of that. I'm just a tractor rookie. But that's scary stuff, uh, getting on and off the tractor. Uh, obviously, safety switch shut the tractor off, but you can see just the just my weight getting off of there or moving those tires just a hair uh, clearly brought this off the ground. When we put the rim guard in the back tires, we're going to find out what the difference is. There's going to be a difference of about 600 pounds on this particular model. So when we do that, we'll see what happens. All right, I hope you can hear me okay. So we're going to put the uh, rim guard in here this afternoon in, the, in these back tires. See the tank over here behind me and see what kind of difference it is. I'm gonna probably just leave these tires here, keep an eye on them today until we get this tractor filled, and then we'll do the same exercise. All right, guys, so we're in the process of filling this bad boy up with rim guard to uh, get these tires full. Then we're gonna do our exercise again, see how it goes. So rim guard's gonna improve your stability. It's gonna put the weight right where you want it on your back tires. It's gonna enhance your lifting capacity, your pulling capacity just makes your machine work better and it gives you better traction both in snow heavy rain mud whatever your situation is whether it's grass almost 11 pounds 10.7 pounds per gallon 25 percent heavier than water it's non-toxic non-corrosive never rush your rims environmentally safe for you the environment the animals on your area wherever you're working. It's freeze resistant up to uh, 35 below. It's just a super great product. Plus it's gonna dramatically improve the ballast and performance on your tractor. So Rim Guard's offered at most uh, reputable tractor dealers. You can look up on their website at Rim Guard or uh, just do a Google search and you'll find uh, places like Calis River Rigging that have Rim Guard available. If you haven't added to your tractor when you buy it, like I suggest to everyone that comes in here, then you can always add it later. Get it safe, and get it sound, get your tractor ready to perform. Right, so we put 600 pounds of rim guard in the back of this tractor, got the same tires on the pallets, and now I'm gonna see how this is gonna feel with a rim guard in the tractor, picking up these tires. All right, I realize this is not super scientific, but let me just tell you that it feels completely different. I could actually drive around with this load 
probably wouldn't be recommended necessarily, but because it is sticking out a ways on the forks, I realized that I was trying to find the perfect weight and distribution to, sh to demonstrate to you uh, the difference between loaded tires versus unloaded tires. But you can see I stepped off. It had no impact on the load and it even looks more stable just looking at it. Maybe because it, I felt better. I didn't feel that scary thing in my bottom when uh, I was trying to lift it. So there you have it. Hey guys, I appreciate you tuning in and checking out the video. I realized that this was not an exact science. Realize this was not an exact science, my little experiment. But let me just tell you from experience of driving a tractor, a compact tractor for the last five years, over 23 acres, you know, uh, having 600 pounds of ballast right under your bottom even when you're adding an implement or not adding an implement, which hopefully you're adding something, is so much safer and it feels so much better when you're uh, operating the tractor. So hopefully you enjoyed this video, gave you some things to think about. And if you haven't added ballast, uh, consider RimGuard. Uh, it's a great way to go. Talk to you soon.